Hey, Cormdeo Church, Pastor Billy here with a quick announcement and update for you guys. Uh, so many of you know, we launched the church in March of 2020, and like most of the world, we had to pivot pretty quickly from our uh, gathering plans. And so we scrambled, we came with an idea, and I did the world's worst live stream back in March of 2020. Since then, we've upgraded and we've done a live stream. It's not the best quality, but it has served our purposes, and it was always meant to be kind of a temporary placeholder in the life of Quorum Deo Church rather than a replacement for gathering together with the local body, worshiping and serving together. Recently, maybe if you've watched the live stream, you've noticed we've had some technical difficulties, everything from the video cutting out to audio, and it's led us back to the drawing board to have a discussion about, do we wanna upgrade and work towards improving the live stream, or do we want to reevaluate the purpose of the live stream entirely? Again, as I already said, it was supposed to be a placeholder, temporary really just for the time of the pandemic, but over time it's just become a routine, something that we've done every week, and it's led us to ask the question of, why are we doing this? What's the value of it? We started to ask the question, what's the utility of the live stream? What's its purpose? And that led me to this Dane Ortland quote that I wanna share with you. Dane Ortland says this, he says, staying home to watch church is like staying home from a friend's wedding to watch the ceremony virtually and keeping your wedding gift with you. Your presence and solidarity and love and hugs and eye contact and singing are needed. It's not just about passively receiving something. It's about being an embodied part of the celebration. The whole event is diminished by your absence and you have a gift to give. In light of that idea and really what the scriptures teach us that gathering together as the saints to celebrate, to sing, to worship, to rejoice that our King is alive, we see the value of emphasizing and encouraging you to participate on Sunday mornings as we gather together. We wanna to invite you to come on Sundays, especially when you're here in town and, and don't make the decision to, well, I woke up late or things are difficult, I'm just gonna stay home. We understand though, that there are moments when the live stream is a massive benefit Perhaps you are on vacation, or maybe you're ill and you need to stay at home. So we want to encourage you to know, we will still be putting out video, just delayed. The benefit of this is we have existing equipment that is already gonna be better quality. We don't have to worry about technical hiccups or difficulties. We know that the video will be much better than our existing live stream. And so we will continue to put this content out weekly for you. So all in all, what's the purpose of this announcement? Simply this. We are discontinuing the live stream. We want to invite you to come and to be with us on Sunday mornings. If you cannot make it for whatever reason, we will have both sermon audio and video available later in the week. We're so grateful for you, Coram Deo. We wanna encourage you to continue to be a part of what God is doing here in Morganton. Thanks for watching this announcement.